Welcome to Do It Yourself with Mona. Today I'm going to try out the turmeric face mask. We've, I've actually done a few times myself already, but go through this one together. So first a teaspoon of turmeric. Uh, a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar, shake it. Ooh, smells awful. <laughs> uh, a teaspoon of milk. You can use any milk. Um, if you don't drink animal milk, you can use plant-based milk as well. And a teaspoon and a half of honey. Any honey of your choice. Um, organic honey is probably better, but whichever honey you have in your cupboard will do. Okay. And then you just mix it all together into a paste. Make sure it's not runny so it doesn't drip when you apply it on your face because turmeric stains. So the last thing you want is staining your clothes. So some of the benefits of turmeric is brightening your skin, it's really good for acne, it's good for soothing dry skin, but my main purpose for using it is to brighten up my skin. So I have dark areas around the outside of my skin, mainly around my chin, and um, so I'm going to focus the mask around those areas and then go in lightly with the rest of my face. This dries very quickly and will get tight very quickly too, but that's okay. Um, I usually leave it on for about 10 minutes. So after I um, washed off the mask, um, actually before I washed it off it was really really tight. I left it on for about 10 minutes. You can leave it on for longer if you prefer to get a bit more um, tightness but I think 10 minutes is enough for me um, so after I wash it off with some warm water I used the mono rose water to just wipe my face and get rid of any residue that might still be there which apparently is a lot <laughs> um, so Maybe I should do that twice. Um, let's get a bit more. This this uh, rose marcella water smells so good, but not overpowering. Quite subtle as well. And then after that, I usually go in with the rose facial <coughs> toner. Just a couple spritz. Smells so good. Um, I usually let this set for about 10 seconds because afterwards I'm going to go in and use my Daily Defense moisturizer with Q10 and SPF 25. So, I mean, it says use about two to three pumps, but I love this moisturizer, so I'm just going to go in. So the rose water toner actually set very quickly so it's made applying the moisturizer so much easier, basically melts onto my skin. And to finish off, whoop, <laughs> to 
finish off, I use the oily skin facial oil. Now that sounds crazy, oily skin and you're using more oil, but it's actually the best. So if I'm using this before I go to bed, I would put about three pumps and just kind of put it all over my face and my neck. But because I'm heading out and it's the middle of the day, I'm just gonna go in and use it as a highlighter. This is actually also really good to apply over foundation. Just gives it that natural shine. And that's it.